Okay, this is going to be a demonstration of how you would receive uh, T Fuel or Theta or both into your Theta wallet. So I am at the wallet.thetatoken.org website, which gives you this web interface for your wallet. And this video assumes that you've already created a wallet. If you haven't, there's another video on how to do that. So, the first thing you do is choose your key store file. So, I'm going to click on that. And it's going to open this up. And there's my key store file right there. If it doesn't open to the exact location where your key store file has been stored, just navigate to it and select it. So I'm going to double click on that and now it shows that the key store file is set meaning I've selected one and now it wants me to enter the password that was used to create that key store file. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay, I'm in the wallet. Shows I've got zero theta and I've got 0 0.00001 T fuel. And if I want to receive theta or T fuel into this wallet, the wallet address is up in the right hand corner up there. Or you can just go over here and click receive and it's going to pop this window up. And if you're using a mobile wallet, you can just scan that uh, QR code there. But uh, if you're using your computer, you can just go up here and click copy. And now it shows this message that your address has been copied. Now, uh, a precaution that you need to take is make note of the first four characters of that address and the last four characters of that address. So that when you paste it into some place, wherever that may be, you compare and make sure that nothing changed between the point that you copied it and the point that you pasted it. If there's been any kind of a change to it, your Theta will be going to an unknown wallet and you'll lose it. So take that extra time and be careful. So uh, now you would just simply go to whatever site. If you're using like one of those swap sites, it's going to ask you for the address of your wallet where you want it sent and you'll use that address. And it's that simple. Well, I hope this was helpful. If it was, hit that thumbs up button on the way out if you would. I'd appreciate it, and I'll see you in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, please like it, share it, and most importantly, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.